Attack of the Baseball Cards in Union, New Jersey runs a summer essay contest every summer. It's a great chance for kids to learn about different sports athletes and heroes of the past. Also learn how to do research for school by writing essays. Each week, uh, the children that hand in essays receive free cards. Each week, there's a winner that's picked. Uh, the winner, every week, receives packs of cards. And at the end of the summer, we give all our winning essays to a judge who picks out a winner for the entire summer. This, this summer, our special judge was Bill Daughtry, a sports personality with ESPN Radio. We're very lucky to have Bill do the judging for our essay contest this year. He read all the winning essays for this summer. Uh, several of the finalists have been invited here to Pack Wars today. Uh, several people who were in the contest are also here today. So at this time, we want to announce the winner of our 2011 Summer Essay Contest. And we did have hundreds of essays that were done this year. The winner of this year's Summer Essay Contest is Thomas Gilmartin, who wrote an essay on Fred Merkel. Thomas is here with us today. I want to congratulate Thomas. Uh, what town are you from? from Cranford, New Jersey. This is the winning essay. It was an essay that was done on Fred Merkel, uh, New York Giants baseball great from the back of the turn of the century, and for winning our summer essay as selected by Bill Daughtry from ESPN Radio. You get this box of Topps Baseball. It's 2011 Topps Baseball, and it does have a special commemorative patch card in it. You also get a set of 2009 Goodwin Champions Baseball. Goodwin Champions has cards of players from all different sports, not just baseball. It also has historical figures. And Tom's will also get lots of special entries for different contests that we have throughout the year. He'll be invited to a lot of our contests, courtesy of Attack of the Baseball Cards throughout the year. His uh, story will appear on our website for the entire year so everyone can read it. And it will also appear in a couple newspapers, uh, the Suburban News. It should be in in a couple weeks. And it will also be in the patch, uh, the patch uh, newspapers on the Internet. So we want to congratulate Thomas at this time. Everybody give Tom a big round of applause.